Hey guys, how's it going? Firebox here. We are back with another Divine Protection Cleric build. The last time I made a video, it was based on having exactly 35% PDR. But I decided what would happen if we built a full PDR Cleric and instead sacrificed our move speed to be more tanky in fights. And what I found is that you're able to bait players into fighting you and then popping your ability when they think you're weak. And oftentimes, you're able to kill them because most people will just commit full on, which I find absolutely hilarious. Let's very quickly go over the gear that I'm using for this build and then get into the PvP. We're going to be doing Blunt Weapon Mastery, Perseverance, Advanced Healer, and Protection from Evil. And of course, Divine Protection along with our spells, which are going to be Holy Strike, Lesser Heal, Sanctuary, Protection, and Bless. I think these are by far the best spells in the game. And I think these are by far the best perks in the game for Solo Cleric as well. Gonna be using the club. I think this is the best Cleric weapon. It's basically a Falchion, just slightly worse. And honestly, the Falchion is such a good weapon. I have a hard time not using it. I'm gonna be running the Heater Shield instead of the Buckler because it has a bigger radius to block. And quite frankly, they're a lot cheaper than Bucklers right now. So it just makes the build a little bit easier to get. Purple Hound Skull for the armor rating. If, if you can find any decent stats on top, that's a plus. Anything with plus armor rating is just going to make the build better because your total armor rating with this build can be anywhere from 50 all the way up to 60% PDR that I've seen personally, depending on how geared out you are. Templar armor is required. If you can find plus armor rating on this, it's really important just because of the amount of armor you're getting just from this piece alone. Heavy leather leggings. Because again, we need the armor, but it also gives 5 Vigor, which is quite nice. Using heavy boots, because 1, it's the higher armor rating pair of boots, and 2, the strength isn't bad. We want to make sure we're above 15 if possible, just to make sure we're hitting for decent damage. Also going to be running a pair of reinforced gloves. Do have some armor on these, but the Vigor is very nice. Honestly, the more health you can stack on this build, the better off you're going to be. You're just trying to extend the fight as long as possible. Running a Mercurial Cloak. I only have this on because I found it. To be honest with you, if you really need armor, you could consider a Watchman Cloak like the one I found here off the guy that I killed. It's up to you. You could run Vigor. You could run Watchman for the additional armor because it does have a lot more armor rating than other cloaks. It just depends on how much PDR you're trying to hit and what stats that you really need. For trinkets, I personally have been going for damage instead of magic damage. The only magic damage that we're getting is Holy Strike, and it just doesn't feel as worth it. I think it's probably worth building it out a little bit, but I feel like the damage coming from my club just feels more impactful because I don't have Smite and I don't have Judgment. If any of you out there have been using this build and find differently, feel free to let me know in the comments. I am interested to hear. I've only played this build a little bit, so I don't have a lot of experience, but I know it has been working out pretty well. Let's very quickly go over the downsides of this build. It's very slow. With our weapons out, we're sitting at like 75% or lower movement speed, which is very, very slow. This means that it's very hard to chase down players, and it's very hard to get away from players. What you really don't want to do is you don't want to fight wizards, you don't want to fight warlocks. They are by far the hardest class to fight, but you are going to do really well against barbs, against fighters, and anybody else that's doing physical damage. I've also found that fighting other classes, for example, like a ranger, it's not the end of the world. You can't really kill them, but they can't really kill you either because you have such a high armor rating. You can kind of just leave the area and maybe they'll chase you, but... Most rangers aren't going to chase you completely to the ends of the earth because, again, it's going to be pretty darn hard for them to ever kill you with this kind of kit. I am definitely not entirely convinced that this build is better than a race car variant of the protection build. I personally built a kit that's sitting at 110% movement speed with the 35% PDR required. And I do think that's very, very good, and it has different good and different bad matchups. Overall, movement speed is king in solos. So feel free to try this build out if you like, and decide for yourself based on the fights whether you think it's something you want to give a try. Hopefully this guide helped you, let's go ahead and start the montage. Why is it so dark? Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> I don't, I don't know what that was, but okay. Oh wait, he actually had some okay gear too. No, I don't need you to help. Go away. I just don't want him to f hit me when I'm trying to play. No, go away. I don't need your help fighting. Just leave. <laughs> You're going to be real scared when I get to you eventually. Dude, go... I really want this guy to leave, but he's not leaving. Go away! God, dude, this guy needs to go away. I, like, I'm not trying to team with him, but... I mean... Whatever. No, our Timmy! No, our Timmy! He turned to me, he's gone! We did it! We we did we baited him! We that's exactly what you're supposed to do! Oh my god, that's that's literally it! That's it! That's it! That's how you do it! You bait him! Oh my god, we I can't believe we got like a perfect example. That's exactly what I was saying. Let him get a few hits, think that you're about to die, pop your ability, and it's free. Timmy, don't do it. Don't do Sorry, Timmy. You, you can't just loot the body. Sorry, Timmy. Oh, boy. Pretty good gear. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, he was pretty good. Definitely want to pre-buff through. I don't think he'll fight me, though. Seems like he's already, you know, on his way out of here. Man looted this entire area and dipped. I don't really expect most people to W key me. Oh, there's a player. Careful. We're gonna get ya. What? <laughs> you better be careful. We're gonna get ya. <laughs> Eventually. <laughs> Dude, just you wait when I start growing, uh... Just you wait till I start growing gray hairs. You're gonna be real sorry. Oh, that's a different player. What the hell are you teaming? <laughs> Teamers. I'm gonna wait for my skill to come back. I'm, I'm literally just wasting time for, uh...
Come here, Barb. Come back here! Come here, Barb! You, your teammate died! You're not getting away. Come here. Yes! Screw you, Barb! Teaming and you lost. Dude, wh that Barb that came out of nowhere? What a- what a godsend. What a guy. I'm just glad this guy didn't aggro. Eh, no one really cares about quarter stuffs. It's just so stupid. <laughs> okay, sure. Yeah, we'll just... <laughs> we'll just... We'll just take all this... Uh oh. Yeah, I probably let him hit me like one too many times, to be honest with you. But it's okay. Yeah, I was trying to. I think I might have. Yeah, I probably put it a little close there, but it's okay. It was fun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. I love getting carried by EDR. There's a limit to how, how close you need to make a fight, and I think I'm making them. Way, way, way too close.
Okay. Sure. Yeah, that's a rogue for you. That's like exactly how a rogue fight goes. Almost to a T. I love when barbs commit. I want this gear. Oh, you... Oh, I should have known that was coming. I wanted his gear. I wasn't willing to leave the gear to even get four stashes. I play too many characters to get it reasonably. We really just need more stash space, man. Three is not enough. We did it! We did it! We killed him! Woo! We actually killed him! Damn. You had good gear too. Tough look. Oh! Thanks. Oh my god, look at that! That is a godly pair of leggings! That is a good pair! Thanks. Appreciate it.
Jesus. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give the video a like. It really helps the channel. Sub for future content and comment below what you're thinking of the PDR build and just the meta currently in general. And as always, I want to thank Kid Brutal and Barty AR for supporting this video alongside all my other members. Thank you all. Have a great day.